So guys, Dwit Shastriya with another video and in this video I'm gonna show you how to increase the speed of uh, uTorrent. So the date of today is August 23rd and so I've searched on the internet and I find some, I found some trackers to load into it. So I'm gonna give the link to it so even you can load the trackers into it. But till then I'm gonna show you some uh, little settings you can do uh, to download, to increase the speed of the uTorrent downloads. Now, by increasing speed, I mean that if you have a if you have a download speed of uh, say 200 kbps or 500 kbps, it might help you go to 600 or 700. That's the most stretch it can do. But uh, if you're like having a really good internet and not getting or getting very less speed, then this might be able to help you out. So the first thing we're going to start with: make sure the download, the bandwidth allocation is high. So make sure the first thing, the very first thing, make sure this. Now we go to preferences. You must have seen many of the settings online and everywhere. You must have seen like uh, changing some settings, changing some values. And even I have seen, but uh, this setting so far has helped me a lot. I get a constant download speed of uh, 4.5 Mbps nearly, nearly and uh, sometimes my average speed goes to 2.5 mbps so that's a good thing because I, I have a 4g net so i'm gonna show you first of all we're gonna go to connections connections you make sure enable upnp porting map in you make sure this is ticked uh, nothing else here now we go to bandwidth now i'm gonna wait for some time and you can copy the exact same numbers i put in those boxes and yeah so the maximum upload rate is 10 the download rate is 5500 now i have a download rate of 5500 because my net stretches up to 4.5 mbps uh, if you have a less uh, if you have a slower net speed you can try uh, putting a low value inside that box so it doesn't sound too big so that, uh, that's it and uh, make sure the global maximum number of connection is 2329 the maximum number of connected peers is 299 and upload slots per torrent is 14 so that's it for the bandwidth and for the, for the now we're gonna go to queuing yeah so maximum number of active is one number of active downloads one ratio 200 uh, that must be default uh, setting in all of you the uTorrent so no need to change in that now we're gonna go um, to advanced so in advanced here we have these values so find out bt.connect speed and you need to change the value whatever it is to the value I put here it's a star and an 80 so no need to put the star when you change the value to 80 it will by default put in a star inside that so it will get you to know that you cha you have changed the speed for that now that's one I'm gonna show you the other one which I changed the speed of it's gonna be a star yeah GUI onboarding this is false make sure this is false one more is GUI show no torrents node make sure this is false too and uh, magnet download weight of 60 make sure that too uh, yeah net max half open this is the important part you need to put 100 whatever value it is just put in 100 and uh, it'll obviously come with the star in it so that's pretty much the settings I know you can even check out these settings if they are any important to you so here I have an automatic catch size of specify and the size manually 1800 so that's the override automatic catch size and uh, that's it I think that's it so this might help you get a nice download speed one more thing if you double click on the torrent it opens the torrent yeah what a shitty thing I am if you go to properties and if you go see the maximum upload rate here you can change your settings or uh, whatever you like so if you are getting a download speed of say 2.5 mbps then in the download rate put in 3000 I will put here zero so if you want to start the download really nicely put in upload rate at 8 and download rate at zero so that's unlimited then eventually you increase the download speed and uh, you can even decrease the upload rate so that the download increases that's what I have noticed that's what I have experienced so I'm telling you I don't know if uh, it will work on each and every one of your computers but uh, 
I think that's it and that might help you I'm gonna show you one example here I downloaded the sims 4 get together and I can show you the average speed I was getting was 2.5 mbps and uh, it touched down to 5.5 mbps of a download speed at a point where I was so excited that I threw my laptop and it was broken and uh, <laughs> yeah so that's it and uh, uh, make sure to like subscribe and uh, comment if you want anything else and that's a weird screen in front of you don't mind that